So what do you think of the accommodation here? Um, the accommodation here is pretty good. Yeah. You can uh, pay for a single room or you can share with somebody. But uh, overall it's a lot better than I expected. Were you hoping it to be that good? Um, well, in a way, I, I wasn't sure what it was going to be like, whether it was going to be just living in a little shed with, you know, with the monks. But um, yeah, it was, uh, I'm, I'm happy the way it turned out in the end. I'm guessing after like sort of three months of being here, you, you do need a little bit of comfort, right? Uh, yeah, you need, your, you need your own space. After a day's training, you just like to be on your own, just relax, listen to music, watch a bit of TV. Back home, just before I came, a couple of months prior, I was actually sick, so, um, and I was very weak. And then, so I decided, when I decided I'd come here for six months, the first month was, was quite tough because um, I, just, I was very low in energy. But uh, after, after about a month, I felt a lot better than I ever did. And now I feel, I feel like the top of the world now. So physically, I'm a lot stronger than I ever was. And uh, I'm really, really happy with the progress. So in one sentence, how would you describe your overall experience here? Um, well, it was, for one, it was exciting. It was something new. It was um, really enjoyable. And um, I just, I'm just really, really glad that I came. Now there's a lot of martial arts to choose from. Why Shaolin Kung Fu? Well, obviously every martial art is derived from Shaolin Kung Fu. And um, other martial arts are very specific in their area, whether it's a kicking style or a throwing style or a punching style. Whereas Shaolin Kung Fu is, is pretty much everything. It's like the overall picture. So you actually get a, you experience every single st a part of martial arts. A big part of Shaolin Kung Fu are of course the weapons. Now there are 18 in total. Many of them originally come from farming implements. And so you can still see the similarity. Xiao Hui here, he's going to give us a quick demonstration of how some of them are used. Xiao Hui, what do you call this? This we call Da Dao. In English, we call Big Sword. Uh, this side is um, Big Sword. It's wood, wood stick. This side also is um, metal. So the um, little circle is for the weight. It's if you want to make your sword more heavy, and later, yeah, if you want to cut more heavy, you can put more weight on a little small circle. This side also, so you can cut like this. You can block, yeah, block, and cut this way again, and cut again. This way also, you can, yeah, like, just like a spear. Yeah. Okay. So there's many different ways of killing someone with yeah, this, yeah, right? Yeah. Okay. And here we have, what do you call this one? We call Yue Ya Chan. Like, um, Yue Ya Chan. So look, watch. This way look like Muay. 